Oh, those are quits and ignore them. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll just play it first. So it's a pattern. So once you get the pattern down, you'll be able to do this. Uh, so two chords, that's it. It's called an A major. A, C sharp, E, and then D minor, D, F, A. So just practice going back and forth between those two. Memorize them. And then you're going to break them up by playing your pinky first, and then the other two. The melody in the right hand. Don't be afraid, it's a little dissonant. It's okay. Uh, so you're going to go with your fingers, you're going to smush them. Start so on your second finger. And then we're going to go to the next part. You do that twice, and then you go to the next part. So you start on your thumb on A, third on D, second finger on C sharp. And then... So it's always the same rhythm, but you just change the notes. Um, and then when you go to put it together, this is the fun part, you start, first two notes, okay? You're going to stop there, that's, don't be afraid, this is the most dissonant thing that you could play on the piano, but we're going to do it here. Okay? Mm -hmm. In context is good, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> so, and that by itself. So you remember, here's your broken chord. Together, left, and then right. Both of those notes. So just practice that first bit until it's really comfortable. Right, right, together, left, right. you can do that, you can go uh, same pattern, but we went to D minor over here, okay? Mm -hmm. And then you go back to A, and you do the next bit. So you're going to go same pattern, different notes, that's what I'm trying to get to. And then you go back to D here. Okay? Mm -hmm. 